There you go. All right. First game in the throne. I keep calling it Tournament of Champions. It's actually a Throne of Champions. Thank you very much. But I've got a uh, Luke Z top left. Leo starting on the bottom right. A Y V Y. On Arabian Oasis. Now this tournament it was mainly uh, hosted initially by Berg, but uh, Berg just asked for some help from Doofus, Matt, and myself to help organize this entire thing. Which is why I'm I'm here because Berg was uh, Berg was moving, so he was busy. So I stepped in the role for a little bit to organize this entire thing. But we are officially on the way. This tournament, Throne of Champions, is where the top 12 ranking players of the previous months in QM, uh, being January, which is Rich Revenge QM, get invited to a 12 player tournament where the first top four players are seeded into the quarterfinals, while the rest are seeded into a preliminary round, which is the first you're seeing here Luke versus Leo. I believe in the top, uh, not top left, I think it's a bottom right bracket. Oh, we'll see. We'll see, YVY -Y here. Uh, other players include Andy, Marco, Legend, Woody, top four. We've got Tim, Cruiser, Leo, Luke. Um, who do you have else? Kintaya. Um, Zane as well. And Ed, so. So we're going to see some interesting matches here, especially on YouTube events. We've been having a lot of RE2 lately. So it's good to have a little bit of change here. Uh, the most important part is uh, Woody is actually going to be participating as well. But look at this. 3, 4, 5, 6 minus from Luke. <laughs> Leo on 4. But he does have the numerical advantage. Oh yeah, Andy as well, yeah. Andy, Marco, Marco, Woody, and Legend are the top four ranking players. So this is what you normally see in the Yui army. Compositional, compositional, compositional. You got a mixture of units here. Leo looking to be the one down on minus, but he is up on the unit numbers. Let's see if they can make it work. Pressing up onto top left. That mag being there just pushes it back because uh, Luke's Leo's mags actually for the way that <laughs> these two guys having the same like L in the first start of the name is not not helping me at all. Looks like Leo is gonna be pressing up first on top left. They both do get their gems, second patch of gems, uh, having that Yuri minor advantage. That's a huge thing for them. This are now coming up for Leo. He does have the lab out. Luke does not have the lab. Cleo! No! And he comes at first mastermind. You don't want a mega mastermind, obviously, when it drops. It'll uh, drop on your units, but the get there uh, just being mastermind. The two miners taking out the, the get as well, and the mag. The mag can't reduce to one here. Leo overcommitting. The mag, the mastermind does drop. But it does drop and die right away. YVY all of us. Legend doesn't like YVY. I'm surprised these both of them play the YVY. I mean, I, I assume they don't. YVYs are not very light. Very, very, very complicated and annoying to play. Uh, mag versus Mag. Like, who's gonna win that fight? Whoever has a high ground, obviously. Obi Wan. Yeah, obviously, yeah. Watching Y Voice is always a lot more fun. Double War Factory now. Same for both players. Now Leo is getting hit by Luke here. Having that superior numbers. The discs are there. They can out. Uh, they can sort of out, uh, out firepower, outplay the gats there. This is why Luke is backing on here for a bit. Luke now has a lab out with his own disc and mastermind. Mine count still 3 4 1 on the top right gems. Look now with uh, three war fire trees, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine minus. And this is what uh, the Euro army is typically like. It's very small in numbers in different split, but they are basically glass cannons. They have a lot of firepower. Not a lot of firepower, but they do have very annoying firepower. The gats, the mags, the masterminds. 
but their health is not that great. It's why Deso is so prone to these two the mag and the gets here. But we do have a double super weapon here from Leo Luke still with only with that genetic mutator. Spamming out the disc now for wall factories out. Leo definitely far behind here. Luke is steaming ahead with the disc. <laughs> Luke definitely ahead here. Let's see how Leo handled this. He is confined to his own base. He does have the gems on top, right? The Yuri Prime comes out now without a cloning vats. Five war factories now. This is where Yuri's production comes to hand. The four shield comes out for the super weapons. And the this fight actually being pretty even. Leo just getting the upper hand that Luke some of it just are lagging behind. He chooses to sacrifice the buildings for the units from Luke here and he does get them eventually. The gets overturned with an elite coming out. Secondary lab here from Luke. Unfortunately he is broke. He's gonna have a gotta get a fall grinder up. He doesn't have a grinder uh unfortunately before dominating that now he has got some money in the way. The rear prime out for Leo as well. Looks like the death still holding on here, fighting their way through. Leo taking the fight there. He's not gonna win that at all. Too many deaths from uh, Luke. Obviously, having uh, five more batteries. And now the mutator goes the other way. Leo mutating Luke's minus now. Gonna get the power out of the way. The gats gonna clean that up. Yeah, look at this. The Yuri Prime sticking around the back. Uh, where is Luke's Yuri Prime? Not sure where that went. So Luke is now two more factories behind. And comes a Yuri Prime. He's gonna get that MCV. He does. Oh no. Oh, and the cheer right behind a bit. And the power as well. More factory next. Sell that. And gets a lab as well. Unfortunately, he does still have a lab and a grinder down below, but the cheer from Leo. Uh, it's a bit of BM and very funny to see that he does really care, but the disc can deal with that pretty easily. Luke's mine is now going towards mid. So many miners here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Miners. Miners have the infinite health. That's a joke, but. <laughs> no, they're mining on Luke's uh, Leo side of the or Leo side of the map. So, but yeah, this looks like trouble for Leo right now. <clears throat> right now, nobody heard that voice crack. Shut up. Leo definitely in trouble here. He does have the superior eco, but the units that he has is slightly lacking behind. But you know why? You want anything can happen, man. And MCB gets rebuilt here by Luke. But this still being really overpowering. But does get pushed back. The miners are there though. The miners do a lot of damage to the cats and the mags. So Leo has to be careful here. The miners is working. The price pool is $200. I think it should be uh, 150 and 50 to the first and second place. Yeah, now <laughs> Leo is definitely in trouble. Surprisingly, with that amount of eco that he has, he's still built on two war factories. Obviously, because he can't support the eco if he goes more than that. So, that is the trade off that he has here. Two elites, though, out. Leo already won or Luke? Because, you know, YV1, I haven't seen that many YV1 matches. But it's it's uh, it's uh, I don't know, man. But two leads on one end. Couple of this. Luke has the high number of this, but the mags are there as well. 
It's gonna go in anyway. Gung ho all in Luke. Leo as well gonna commit all his units in. The gats are powerful though. It does acting as fodder. It looks like both of them are gonna pull out of it. I think Luke could have definitely won that with the disc. Yeah, you just need to target those two uh, gats and it should be okay because there's one disc remaining here. Luther again goes for Leo. On to Luke. We haven't seen any dominators out just yet. Mastermind's are out that this is on that gat. Have to deal with that the dominator the mutator sorry is slowly going down i don't know chad it look uh, to me it looks like luke already won this fair uh, pretty easily or easily but uh luke won this by a mile four shield coming out clutch at the save there is no micro from luke not from leo sorry God damn it, it's so confusing above the names. Luke, Leo, Leo, Luke. Leo falling again with the disc. That, but that, <laughs> but Luke, sorry, falling, Leo falling with the disc. But that fought is actually pretty good. Luke not targeting at all. That disc finally goes down. In comes the mass mine and the cats now. Luke at a amount of minus here from, from Luke. Clearly, he's far, far, far ahead. Uh, Luke doesn't seem to want to pull a punch through that. Here comes that first Dominator. Takes out three War Factories, I think. He is down to four. There was one here, but got destroyed. He's down to one now. So the production now is in Leo's hands. Only on a map like Arabian Oasis. This is where things would get this long in the YVY. What's up, Mr. Mad? 12 minutes and it's been pretty back and forth there. Liok Liok? <laughs> Dude, I'm losing. I just combined Leo and Luke. Luke losing his MCV, rebuilding it. And has been ahead most of the game actually, except for that one point where Leo actually took out his MCV with that Yuri Prime around the back. But Luke actually failing to sort of punch a hole through Leo and cripple him to the point where he can't really rebuild it's giving him a lot of time here and both players do rebuild there's a U prime again once bitten twice shy Luke should see that U prime incoming now and just deal that easily with a miner or something Leo getting split here this is gonna attack that minor fresh and gold it does go down second mine second miner not getting hit the match pulling in the gats here but the gats on the other hand way too strong the mastermind comes in as well it's luke gonna kill the game here he needs to reinforce but he doesn't want to with that gatling cannon there <laughs> luke almost pulling all this miners hasn't touched the gems on bottom left by the way that mutator is ready and the Bruce could be very much useful here in this attack if he pushes this well and the Yuri Prime comes out for Luke as well in comes a Yuri Prime for Leo where's he going? okay start the defensive structures super weapons can't be of a turn, the war factory goes down, but Luke is not paying attention back in his base. Oh, it gets mutated. Luke coming clutch over the mutated, choosing not to mutate the slaves for money. I guess that's one way to deal with Yuri Prime. Where was the cheer after that, boy? It's but the thing Luke is doing here is actually pulling everything away But the mutator is it defensively there from Leo which is the entire reason why he could pull back the amount of this is scary there but the amount of cats is even scarier
Is it gonna be thrown away this lead that Luke has? No units back in Leo's base. I just bit my tongue out. The the the, the this sound the the do 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 is really getting to my nose. That's <laughs> really annoying. I'm gonna I'm gonna turn that down. Yeah, Luke has a lot of minus. Leo only has three, four. This one in his face. Luke from the get go, I think, made like four or five miners there. From War Factory. Disc in flight. I mean, Luke could pull off his miners and probably take out the War Factory and the grinder. I think he doesn't want to gamble on that because he's low on eco now. Well, somebody comes in is not really that useful. Power goes on to lose power, but in the amount of this that Luke has are way too many. They're gonna overpower the cats as well. At least he's gonna win that this fight. Leo on the back of this still on one, two, three minus. He did have about five previously. But just got down yeah, the other two are up here. He has six now. Yeah, I, I thought Luke was an RA2 player. But apparently not. <laughs> really thought Luke was an RA2 player, but now he comes. Luke going top right where all the miners are and the cats and mouse are actually preventing that from happening. Yuri Prime back in base! Doesn't get the MCV. But the miners are getting hit here. This is good value from Leo. From Luke. Sorry. Confusing names. Really, really good value here from Luke. Hitting Leo's miners. The master miners are there. The he Leo can't push this to defend. He's gonna be on zero minus if these two miners go down. He's gonna go for the base trade. Luke making miners from the war factory. Leo down left to one single miner. In comes the masterminds now. The mute, the dominator, sorry. Goes onto the last war factory and Leo calls GG. After 10 minutes, no, almost 20 minutes, Leo grabs that first point. Yeah, this YVY is. <laughs> it's gonna be interesting for sure. Especially on country swing. I might, I might just leave. I might just leave my camera here while I go grab a drink. Yeah, I'm gonna leave my camera here while I go grab a drink because there's not gonna be any action for like full a full maybe like two minutes or so. <laughs> Hold on. All right, sorry for that. Yeah, look, it's gonna start bottom right. This goes until over or schedule? What do you mean, Nick? Uh! Yeah, we're gonna see many miners here, obviously. Uh, not much of a rush or anything. Luke is walling in his MCV. Probably because of the Yuri Prime, I'm assuming. How many miners here? I'm guessing about 20 billion, gajillion, zillion, trillion. 
already on four each and leo again making four mine four miners only see we've seen this before we've seen this time and time again four miners only and going radar straight away i think luke is gonna go a couple miners uh yeah jay sure uh after this i'll let you in i'm going for the lab already so leo is known to do this going to take quick tech On four minus. Yeah, exactly, Zah. So I'm not too sure why that wall is there. <laughs> Maybe it's just to. Uh, I mean, Max can shoot through walls as well. Uh, I'm sure someone can school me on that in a YVY setting, creating walls around your MCV. Was and many uses. Yeah, I, I'm guessing it's just to like extra extra security. So fifth miner coming out now for Leo. He does go a miner after that lab is up. And Luke late to that lab, but let's see whether Leo can do anything with his push. Couple lashes, one get, two mags, and a mastermind. This are now being spammed out. Still only like one single war factory for both players. Luke on six minus. Leo still on five. Initial push did not do much. Except for maybe pressuring up a little bit here. Luke can now make the counter push. The mutator, sorry, dominator is up first. For Leo. Cleo. Yeah, Leo Leo lost the first YBY. On Arabian Oasis. Players can send their miners up to the gems here. Seems like both players are constantly hitting zero. Luke gonna move his miner down to that second patch. He already has a miner down there. Mutator and Dominator out. Leo lacking one dominator. Disc in flight. Disc in flight. Yeah, man, I saw Luke was playing against Zeno in QM. I saw him in his stream, and he was actually playing really pretty damn well. It's like Rhino was, but a little bit different. There you go, Luke finally sending a miner onto the gems. Leo chooses not to. Still on five miners and he is constantly hitting that zero. Surely that's not good for his production. Luke has a slightly better eco. It's gonna be a lot better now that he has a miner on gems. But Leo on that second war, five miners. That has to hurt him eco-wise. The this war though is won by Leo. I guess in a YVY going on five minus you do have that mutator with the grinder. It's not the worst thing in the world. But looking at how much he's still hitting zero. It's not a good thing. Look there, Luke is trailing away on 7k. Gonna go across the bottom now. Three miners in total. Mutator ready to go. Leo should probably move a couple miners over to the right hand side. B1. And then comes that mutator. No, doesn't see what he hit there. He probably hit a war factory down there. Split from Leo going around the top with three lashes, trying to get that miner. He does push it back, but that miner already grabbed a lot of gems. When he comes at war now, gonna go for the MCB. MCB goes down. It's a wall or no wall. MCB still goes down to the disc there. The gas is not in place. 
distracted by the lashes laptop leo now in the lead he is sending his money to that second all patch the mutator has not been used just yet <laughs> Luke trying to make it trying to make his way along the top it doesn't doesn't really work out for him looks like Luke rebuilt his MCV gonna put it in the back now wise idea Yep, Luke getting two of his war factories up now. He is running away with the money on 12k. <laughs> Leo, on the other hand, has been hitting broke um, time and time and time again. That mutator hasn't been used once to grind any brutes. He does have a miner on gems now. But that eco, man, that eco from Luke, from Leo, sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm a Yuri noob, but the, I mean the basics of RE2, it, even Yuri's revenge. How many warfatches do you go per miner? Um, not really a great thing here, but Leo does have a chance. It's not over just yet, but he keeps hitting zero. Luke is outproducing him at the moment with the better eco. Just swing, very typical player is just waiting to, uh, waiting to do something. Out comes that mutator, finally. Uh, the Dominator, sorry, Mutator is still waiting. Absolutely still waiting. Da -da 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 -da. Left right, center up, down, left to right. AABB in comes an engagement. Finally, the Disc Wars are gonna go at it. Last one is there, but Luke. Seems like Luke is gonna win it actually. The Mossman is not taking care of the Gats and the Mags. Leo coming back. Gonna hit the last two this there. Three more incoming as reinforcements. The get cannon is now there. Leo running to trouble here, getting himself stuck between the rock and a hard place down the bottom right. Couple of this left remaining for Leo. Never mind the singularity. I didn't see that there. It's very very hard to tell me this uh, similar with sea choppers, man. They go right over each other, then one more factor goes down. A well-placed mutator could help Leo a lot here. <laughs> He's running away with the miners. Leo now on 14k. After getting those gems down in the bottom left hand side. And uh, the mutator is still not, still not going. So that, that push actually was really well. Uh, went, went good in Leo's favor. I didn't really see that many discs. Obviously the singularity allowed them a stack behind each other. You can never actually tell how many discs are there. It's hard to judge, but Leo does come on top, which is what the ultimate thing is. Luke was ahead in eco, but now his eco is all stuck on the bottom left. It's a prime target for the disc right there. Leo now on four, five, six war factories. Can do some damage here with the production. I don't think Luke is gonna win that disc fight though. The mags are gonna help with the gats along that mastermind. And Luke has to be careful where he goes to Leo taking over those masterminds. The gats are in taking out the disc as well. Be one with you. Dominator taking out another couple of war factories once again. And the lack of units here from Luke is gonna hurt him a lot. Two war factories remaining. He's now low power. Gets the power up again, but that power shield is gonna go down here next. 
Leo gets on that power disabling and it gets slowing down the production Dominator goes down he leaves a couple of this on there takes down the penultimate war factory and the last one is standing right there looks like Leo even though he was on five minus most of the time finally gets ahead and takes the second match to bring it back one two one what face you on see me? this map too often huh yeah yeah exactly exactly this is an interesting map pick but Luke clearly has a plan here obviously going out right player defeated oh there he goes yep both players going at it <laughs> makes sense oh this is great I can just put my uh, mouse right here oh pre-capture as well so Instantly, I'm thinking France. There's a reason Luke went France and he's gonna forego that war factory until the AFC is up. And it's, I think it's gonna be a bad time for Leo here. Yeah, it's France too. So. Uh, it's gonna be a really, really bad time for Leo. Yeah. I mean, we'll see how he goes. He surely is gonna forego the war factory. A couple GIs out, anti scouts. That's a refinery. The timing is exactly the same. Making an engineer there with those pre caps. Here we see which he goes to whether Luke. Ooh, he's gonna try to steal the oil. Right. Okay, he goes for the AFC first. Of course, in this shorter range, you want that cannon. Yeah, <laughs> tried to steal, but didn't really work. Here comes that power. Where's the cannon? I'm waiting for it to get. The thing is, the only the only chance that Leo has a way to win here is to get the disc out. This will instantly like counter any cannon going up here. So he has to get a war factory out of the way, but he does have the radar. He lose the war factory though. Mm-hmm. If he gets baseball here, it's gonna be a really awful thing. Leo trying to use that bunker, not really working out. And what can you do here? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> you, you have to build from the back, which means you're gonna give map control up. And I mean, in this case, you're giving up map control. Oh, it's gonna go boomers? I got the radar. Yeah, he can make boomers. Can, can he survive this long to make boomers? He's gonna have to go all the way around. All the way around the deck here. Oh, there are two cats on the back of his base. So, we're gonna go for the AFC. Billboss is out. This is gonna counter that pretty easily. I think this is definitely one match for Luke here. <laughs> Leo backtracking. This is. Moving back home. Yep. Yeah. I mean, he should have done that a lot earlier. Yeah, sell the, sell the submarine yeah. pen as well instantly map control here i mean leo could probably overcommitted that to the middle a little bit knowing that he's france he's gonna get map control either way probably a better just to back out a little bit earlier he gets the mtv with the boomers um could help mm -hmm. i'm not sure whether he made uh, any yeah i mean what it's oh yep there it is all right I think he's gonna get know. it. Oh, he's not gonna run away. Oh, he is. Yeah, it's the right move. But I mean, what what can what can Leo do here? Yeah, he's just probably gonna move his MCV like even closer. To, yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't work well for Leo at all. MCV is not closer to him. Oh no. The so Warfare War actually does push him back. Oh, got the AFC though. Yeah, that's gonna slow me down quite a bit. GI is now doing a lot of work. Huge red GIs. Empty tank bunker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That was funny. It's hoping for uh, for it to our range, but now that the AFC is up again, and that boomer did it die? That boomer? Or is it going all the way around again? I'm just gonna steal the oil. This is a lost game for Leo for sure. 
There's a boomer again going for the A barracks. Luke not really up to it. There's a cannon. Push back the bunker walk. Oof. Nice area. Yeah, Leo now broke. He can't do anything. No oil as well. This is GG for sure. There you go. He had a plan. You're right. Mm -hmm. I mean, when someone goes France on a on a pro game, it definitely has a plan. Yeah, on a small map like this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Specifically, pick the map as well. That's second point to Luke. All right, for once, is it gonna be different than a YVY? Oh Ooh, wait, back to I, I forgot to turn on super weapons. Shit. I put them in the same spot. Player defeated. Wait, super weapons are turned off? Uh, they're, they're turned off for AVY. Battle control terminated. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Should be turned on for SVY. Uh, oh, I'll we'll go around them again. Doesn't matter. So for that, she was good for me. <laughs> yeah, we'll go, we'll go to the spot. Alright, try that again, nothing happened. Now this SVY is gonna be interesting. Sort of the uh, the two YVY games that were literally like 20 minutes long each <laughs> earlier. But Luke is gonna sound the right, the top left. We're definitely gonna see a lot of a different playstyle here than the normal matches that we used to see. A couple, not really a couple, but a lot of drones and a lot of flak. Not really that many rhinos, but gonna see how Luke plays out to this SVY. As far as I know, Luke is a R2 player, but he has played about 300 plus. You revenge QM. That's a lot of coins for an anti scout. I wonder what he has planned. Jesus. Oh my. Luke, chill. Is he gonna go broke if he doesn't doesn't take care of that, my dude? And the, the brute gets through anyway. This is definitely a corny rush, not really a anti scout here from Luke. Um. Okay. Well. That's a lot. <laughs> that's definitely a lot. I thought I was to anti scout, and I'm like, okay, sure, anti scout. Then it's not anti scout. It's a rush. When you, you just play how much at this point. Oh, Chaos the, drone, huh? Chaos drone, yeah, that's a perfect counter right there. Yeah, that's half of the con is gone. Luke gonna go zero and follow up here, but he is broke now, obviously. He did go like 10 million conies. He's gonna pressure up on Leo here. Leo also broke. Barris goes down, no gats. Use the miners. The miners are so fucking OP. Now he's bringing them. There you go. He's gonna bring down the warfare. He goes down anyway because he was ulting. And the cat goes down as well. Gonna go for the power next. Oh no, Leo. Cleo. No. He's in trouble. Yeah, those two elites doing a lot of work as well. Oh, yikes. Leo definitely in trouble here. His last hope are the miners to help him. Which means that he will be broke if he doesn't uh, get them back to working. Even more here. Luke is gonna go double up on gems. Long distance mine, that's fine. Wow. I mean, so why, why didn't Leo see that anti scout? Uh, that scout from the brute? Surely he would have seen it by now. Like uh, when when the brute got through, the brute got through his base and went into both groups of conies, but he still didn't see it and still went a miner instead of maybe a couple of gats or even more than one chaos drone. 
This is troubling here. And he's just doing circles. I <laughs> know, right? The blues are actually a really good counter. Yeah. There you go, four of them taking one out so easily. God damn. Way, way to hold him off, man. That, mm -hmm. was, that was pretty good. Yeah, he held them up for a while. I tried to get a barrier up, but really couldn't get it up. But unless. But when, when he finally did, he got the bruise out. So he, he knows what a proper counter is. But the radar is not out for Luke. He is on 3, 4, 5, 6 minus. Luke. Leo, sorry, on 3. And he's been broke for so long. <laughs> it's gonna take like forever to recover. Got yeah, crazy Ivans and Dessos and Engineers. Oh, is that really what it is? I see. Yeah, there's an Ivan, a Deso, and an Engie. Oh boy. I don't. I think it's just a Deso in that black track that's coming. Mm-hmm. <laughs> just one. We got a whole family in here. Yeah. Start building flag troopers. Let's go. That's a Deso. Ooh. That's a nice counter. The miners can definitely take it out, but it's gonna be annoying because the slaves won't be working. And there's the there's the family up top. I have an NG. Here they come. Still waypointing him. Oh, he's walking. Oh. He's walking. Oh no! What? <laughs> what the desolator? <laughs> he killed himself. Yeah, what? the desolator deployed too early and it killed the NG. The oh, NG was gonna get it. Oh my god. Oh my god, okay, he does have an IC in the lab on now, but what was that? Yeah, Snipe <laughs> the miner. I don't know if that was a troll or something, but uh, Luke can definitely keep up the pressure. Those two brutes are still there. He needs some flag to deal with the brutes, and if one of the brutes gets elite, <laughs> that's gonna be hard to deal with. As a flag, you can deal with the brute pretty well if you uh, control shift them all the way back. Oh dear god, I hope Luke doesn't throw this. Once that IC is up, it should be over getting like most of the miners out of the way. This is the thing of Yuri, man. You, you gotta. The long range capabilities of it, the annoyingness of the masterminds and the mags. Really, really easy to defend with Yuri. Yep. There's a drone. Ooh, Ooh Deso. Nice, takes care of that mag. The miner top left gets rid of as well. Three miners left. And here goes the IC. It's gonna hit the lab, probably get a force shield out of the way. Or get that power. And then go for the MCV. No force available, MCV goes down. Mastermind finally comes in now to defend, but damage has been done by Luke here. Taking out one miner. Going for the power and MCV. So he is considerably low power now. Can't really get back from that. No power plants available anywhere. Coming in. What is I mean how is he gonna win this? Leo. Oh Ooh. nice Good play right there. Looks like it's in range again, maybe to do it with the other ore refinery. Oh my god no? it is. Close. Surely it is. Oh the connies are there though. There's no gas there as well, so the drones can definitely do a lot of damage here. It chase a lot of most of my dear. Oh well, Ivan? What? Where? Can Ivan get mind control? He can, right? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But Luke was so dominant there with the early push. Took a little bit of time, but 3 1 now. So Luke can play, I think, both Sov and Yuri. I'm not sure about his ally. But divide and conquer. I and mean, some people say it's a Yuri map, some people say it's a Sov map. We'll see what Leo has in plan. I mean, if, if he pulls out one of the shenanigans, like moving his MCV all the way to his base, capturing it. Or even with the Yuri Prime, with that mind control tower. Tani's coming out again, looks like. Yeah, and if it's more than five, it's definitely a rush. 
Yeah, the rush for sure. Oh, my criminal miner. There you go. So let's see if the Leo can scout this out. Those condis brought him down all the way to 3k. Okay, he's gonna have to anti scout this pretty hard. He doesn't. Oh my god. <laughs> Get him! Get him! Nope. He doesn't. Okay, let's see what Leo does differently now. He goes one get. Couple of chaos drones will be the answer here. He goes a couple of gets. He's gonna have to control shift them pretty well here because the Connors will definitely take care of a get. There you go. He does the right thing this time. He needs that rhino to take care of the gets before he can move into Connors. Is Leo Leo still going a minor behind of this? Two gets and then a minor. Tries to sneak a drone too. Yeah. Sorry, I don't mean control shift. I meant kite though. Sorry. And I don't That's know that one. that bunker is a, is a good idea, but it's gonna try out to do something there. Get some viruses out for the connies probably. Back home, three, four minus one coming up. Yeah, Leo definitely has a better hold of this rush compared to the one on. Uh... Oh, somebody playing for this? Go to speak? Yes. Yeah, there you go. So we've got four minus now. Leo is known for making four minus and not going more than four minus, and they're going super weapons straight away. So we might see a lab and dominator out or a mutator out here. Five minutes for Luke. He hasn't tight up yet. He did spend a lot of his eco on that forward rush. Mm. Well, Leo's got a good little army. He's got uh, like five lashers, a couple gats, and a mag. Mm -hmm. It's a little scary. Yeah, I think Luke is trying to get some desos out to counter that. Yeah, there's a lab out from Leo. Another miner behind that, why not? Watching too much legend. From Luke there. Oh, mastermind is out. Yeah, so setting up defensively. I don't know, man. <laughs> Luke is now broke. He's gonna have to micro his miners a little bit. Yeah, is it? An overcommitment though from from Luke right at the start there. I feel like he could have probably backed out and sort of saved his units a little bit. The Connies, I don't know whether there was too many Connies. I think there was way too many. And yeah, he, and then he was trying to trying to split them too. Like yeah. he had like six six Connie. I'm like I don't know what six Connies are gonna do. You know, mm -hmm. they're, not, they're not uh. Leo, not that once yet. once you see that Leo had the the right counter up in in Gat. And as you control them really well, the split, the, the rush is off. You you can't you can't counter that rush at all. No no, the rush has been counted. That's what I'm saying. So now Leo can make the push once again. A good army here. Ah, oh, the mine is getting hit. Mage masterminds here. Luke has to be careful. Brainwave overloaded there. Does not manage to save it. The drones are now here. That I see ready in three minutes, not so much. He's gonna use it. The get, find the get, does go down. And looks like the gets will draw the entire army except for one single mag. There you go, that's the last mag up. Got <laughs> them all. Drones are all the way. Fuck rhinos, man. Go drones. One, two, three, four, five minus now from Leo. So Leo moves on to a four minor, four minor guy to a five minor guy. Yeah. yeah, Luke's only got three. I think he lost two or three miners. Three miners there. Mhm. Mm I think he, he got magged. Yeah, he's building them under yeah. warfare tree now. Uh, fortunately, that flex is not gonna do a lot of damage. I see he's about to be ready, but he's got nothing. Mhm. Mm yeah, he's making out the drones now.
Yeah, this, <laughs> this is definitely a different sort of place that I normally used to see. Or I haven't seen in quite a while. It looks like they got IC there for Ooh. the. Yeah. Wow. I think it's gonna bypass it and go for the mastermind. There you go. The fucking range of the magman. Look at that. He got his whole army and he only lost one drone. Mm hmm. And <laughs> the rest wow. of it survived. That was pretty solid. Subliminal messages? What? What do you mean? Yeah, that all comes at you with Prime sticking around the back. Do it in that once or twice. The miner gets magged again. Oh, the MTB is not repairing it. Oh, boy. He had a force shield. I'm sure he did. Just yeah. And he didn't repair it either. Yeah. Wow. Yikes. Well. We don't Yuri get... Prime. Yeah. On the move. On the back of that, what does he have? Like, he has everything he needs, but the production wise, it's not that great. Uh oh. Drones are gonna snipe him out right now. Yeah. Oh, and the Dominator is yeah. ready as well. <laughs> yeah, Yuri Prime goes down. The Dominator it's gonna go in that allows one fraction it's gonna be done there you go game over yep game over you Wait. have lost I mean again with that that rush at the start once bitten twice shy I mean as much as Leo didn't see that first scout and that first rush Luke didn't see the counter to the scout to this rush sorry I didn't really like he still committed to that rush even though Leo 100% scouted it and counted it. That's definitely his downfall here. That's his GG. Player defeated. Yep. Alright, 3 2 now? Yes, 3-2. My background apps keep showing. I mean what what is there to see in my background apps? I don't think there's anything. Reconcile. Yeah, apparently uh, this is Leo's favorite map. So might be a vegetable map pack here from Leo, from from Luke. Who knows? Who knows? We'll see. Tech building captured. Player defeated. I know him as an R2 player, Andy. I know Luke as an R2 player, but uh, I think he was he was talking to Gino, saying that he won't play Richard this month. But who knows? This is Zed current. <laughs> yeah. I mean, immediately I'm thinking that obviously Yuri is definitely disadvantaged here on the top right. It's not that big of a disadvantage, but the miners are gonna, gonna be quite far. This the slaves are gonna be quite far from the uh miners. I'm not sure whether they can plant or deploy right there. You repair the bridge? Oh shit! Look at that. And Leo. Stealing, stealing that oil man. Yikes. Oh, I discounted really nicely though. Oh, is it gonna make it? Nope. <laughs> Another rush. Yikes. Yeah, that is huge actually. He just needs a uh, sentry gun to deal with that bunker, that hut. And that rush is actually viable. I, I was looking top right and I heard the thing. I heard the repair bridge. I'm like, whoa. It is pre-captured, so he can do that pretty quickly mm -hmm. with the barracks. Yeah. Just wall it. <laughs> that is an option, just to wall it off. Three minus now for both players. Luke needs to be wary of not over committing to defending this oil. He might uh, just lose too much eco. He's gonna go for the smaller gem patch. Leo choosing to kill it instead of uh, recapturing that oil. He's not gonna put a sentry gun up to, you know. Yeah, he could, definitely could. 
Oh, too late, I think. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think it was broke <laughs> there. He did like a second too late. Mm-hmm. Yeah, definitely too late there to hit the uh, sentry gun there. I think it was broke, definitely couldn't. So you're going to bridge. Uh, yeah, Lloyd, uh, after this, I'll probably restart my stream just to, uh, to, uh, bring it down. I think the quality is a bit too high for some of y'all. Try to, try to bring down the quality if you can. If sometimes Twitch has it, sometimes Twitch doesn't. But if you can bring the quality down, bring it down. If you're not, then I'll uh, I'll, I'll redo it. Yeah, what does the uh, behind of this? Five minus on one all patch now. Six on the gems. Couple of rhinos. Leo still on four minus five. Hey, five minus. And a good sizable army. But uh, it's at the wrong place right now. There's four rentals coming along the right hand side. And what is he gonna do about this push? Desolators. Gonna get and that miner in time. Nice, and the mastermind can definitely be counted here. Oh, the mag! Uh, oh no, the mastermind! Almost gets drilled there. The rhinos are pulling back. The lab is out from Luke. Not that the rhinos are bad. Surely that push is thwarted. But how many miners did he lose there? Jesus. I think about two or three. Two or three. What is he going to do? He's going to go all in here. Leo has to be careful with his minds to mind control. The overload doesn't do it just as the elite comes out. Yikes, man. Pretty back and forth there. Got the dominator out. Yeah, there you go. I see. As well. What? How do you build that far? Huge gem passes have not been touched. It. Touch it! <laughs> Touch it! <laughs> Need a couple flag here, Leo. A uh, Luke. Leo. Yeah, he has a bunch, but his war factory's uh, far away from his MCV. Yeah, he does have the ego to make another one. I mean. But he's dealing with his mags, and the mag goes on the tree. Yikes! And wow, the mag so survives. Wow, so if it drops on a tree, it'll it'll. Uh, yeah, it'll definitely explode. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's really annoying when you're uh, when you're dealing with a lot of it. Ugh. Yeah, there's trees everywhere. I mean, you're, yeah. So many gats, gats flat for that one desert mastermind. I mean, that elite is still there. He, I don't think Luke wants to uh, wants to risk this elite getting mind control. That's that forward war factory. And the forward wrecked as well to get some desolates out. The drones are ready for that, I see. And there's no gats there, so he can definitely drone those really easily before they just get to it. Good marker there from Leo pulling away that drone mastermind. One single get in that knight's army. Definitely gonna get the uh, IC here. Just as he gets those two masterminds out of the way, then he can go in with the rhinos. Or the flag. The flag do quite a bit, uh, quite decent damage against the flag as well. But the split down the bottom left there, taking out one miner. Yeah, that IC was wasted by Luke. I don't know if you saw that. Yeah. Mutator out. B1 with you. Oof. They got a the war factory and a ref, I think. And there was no miners there. I guess it was only the war factory that was doing bits, contributing to society. Normal human being. But that IC was wasted now. Luke gonna come in here. He is broke. 
This man is obviously got hit previously and had to go all the way towards the top right hand side. But the Rhino is now going from left to right. Including the Elite. The four shield is up so he's it's not the end of it if he does get some damage out. But the drones now are ready to come in with that IC in 20 seconds. That Elite just be careful. Elite gets masterminded. And immediately the Elite is set on its way. Unless he grinds it. Yeah, he absolutely grinds it to uh, save it from the drone. For all of the entire Yurami gets drone now. Leo just has to be wow. careful to drone. Send them all in there. Yeah, I think Leo has a micro for it. Yeah, he does have a micro for it. Wow, so. he's got 17k right now. <laughs> yeah, most people would just send the entire army in, but I think Luke. And Luke's broke. Yeah. Because, <laughs> yeah. Gosh. Right, he hasn't touched his gem patch yet. He definitely doesn't want to touch it because of Max. That's for sure. But then what else can he do here? The bits are here now. Flag out of position. Yeah, they're cleaning up. Nuke out as well. <laughs> Is that really a viable strat when you're broke? Yeah. You're still on 5 minus. But he has 17k, so who's complaining here? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> That, that's the reason he goes low minor count because he has a mutator and the grinder is right nearby. Now the IC drones for the top right hand side. I think I'm playing with Yuri in the next while you just keep droning and I see drone and I see drone and I see until they run out of money eventually. And I think Leo is far from gonna go out of money. Luke is actually gonna go broke. Trying the same strike over and over and over again. What will he dominate? B1. He has to go for it. Yeah. More factory up top. Did I hit? Uh, yeah, I think I hit the refinery as well. Oh yeah, you're right. So the only sort of efficient war fat the refineries are remaining is that one small patch. It's gonna have to go back all the way to the left side. He's only two minus there now. <laughs> Wesler. It's a very very long fight. It's coming up to ten and a half minutes now. Yeah, we're at ten minutes. Wow. I mean, not as long as that YV in that first match. That took like twenty minutes. One? Oh man. Four war factories, double super weapons. Oh, comes that drone as he once again. There you go. Flag is taking care of it. I think one of it is droned. Oh no, it's not. Face him down. Yeah, I mean. What? I guess why didn't he push there and chase it? Chase those, you know. Chase those this there here. Go. There he goes. Now he's gone. <laughs> yeah, Nuke is not ready. <clears throat> Prime target here will be the war factories and the power plant. Ooh, yeah, you can. They're right inside. Definitely get two of them for sure. Yeah, there you go. And down the bottom left, they're still going at it here. It goes for the yeah, other one instead. And the and the lab too. Oh yeah, Smart. no force shield. Where can he go? He can't do much, Luke. He was yeah, he kept hitting broke here, but he just managed to regain his eco. And this is, look at top right. This is what I meant by uh, the gems not really. Oh, why are the finer? Are they just is that glitch or something, or the, mm -hmm. are they just like AFK? They're they're deployed onto onto the uh, because the mine the slips come out of that that the, the, the bottom right side. So the slip miners they will deploy there. He has to deploy them further away, I think. Right. Leo has to micro them, but he does have 13k, so it's it's not the worst mm -hmm. thing in the world. The Dominator comes Ooh. out. This is... And Luke now has a lot of money. He's got 11k now. Yeah, he gained from uh, switching over to the left side. <laughs> he, he got all the drones. He can take out the brutes. 
Mm -hmm. Where is he? At? Oh, okay, he's focused on taking him out at the bottom. Yeah. He doesn't need some situations right now. Lab goes on. It's fine. He has what he need. Now he goes in with the drones. Uh, where is he going? I think, I think he's got to use those tanks with that IC. I mean, right? That's what the most ideal. Yeah. Uh, but what is he? I don't know why he's sending his tanks back to his base. <laughs> I don't. What? He had an opportunity uh, there. I think. Yeah. His IC is up now, so uh, yeah. yeah, I don't. Yeah, something else in mind. <laughs> yeah. He's a, he's, he's a pro player. We just noobs. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> There we go. He just had to get his drones and everybody. Mm -hmm. I think the drones on the uh, units that would be a good idea. Yeah. And then he can go in and do some damage with the rhinos. We go again. The micro tower out. Okay, the power next. Just get rid of the war factory before a mastermind comes out of it. Seems to be very scared here, Luke. And the desolates on the cliff doing a lot of work there. Leo finding my crane with a dominator. Oh, and but it dies. The power and the oh, battle lab. Power plants. No, the power plants. There you go. It's denying the disc from being produced. No decks today. And, oh yeah, I need to spend it down bottom left as well. More masterminds. Oh yeah. It's looking good for for Mr. Luke's. Mm -hmm. This is why he has to be careful uh, and try to get bottom left control. If you get, so if, you, if Leo manages to get a couple mags out, the miners are done for. So he's, he can't give up the bottom left control. It's why I think he's starting, starting to reinforce top a little bit more with the desos and drones and everything. Before he can leave bottom left. I was about to say he's not backing up all the way, but he is backing up all the way. They grab most of the gems there, so it wouldn't be that big of a deal if he loses one or two yeah. miners. Oh, oh no! Wow. That mutator is changing everything there. The rhinos now. Gotta get hit. God damn, Luke not paying attention there. This is uh, pretty devastating here. Yeah, there's no no room uh, rhinos as well to get anything yep. out of the way. This not getting them low power as well. Yikes! This huge for Leo. Can he finish out the game here? We get those two war factories out. He's gonna have one left. He definitely will be able to. That's a big yikes from Elite. Luke. No. You can definitely farm the elite. He does out tank him. He's got four veterans right now. <laughs> Any one of them could get Ilya anytime. Yeah. And this two. is uh this is over. It was looking so good for Luke. He's on 24k. No, he just kinda the ties just sort of suddenly turned over. Oh well. I forgot he still had his MCV at the bottom. Mm -hmm. He's got 25k. <laughs> Way too much. Oh my god, he's rolling. Yeah. Yeah, he mined all those gems, so it makes sense, you know. Yeah, Luke needs to rebuild like ASAP. Get a couple of warfare trees down bottom left. The mind control rhinos do go down either way. And he's still trying to deny top right here from any oil from the gem, sorry. There you go, Mike is his miners. Okay. He's got his IC back up, but not having supers for a little bit there was costly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the one thing you need as Soviet against Yuri is supers for sure. I think miner doing some work down the bottom left. That's got taken out either way. And top right, man, still being a nuisance with those, uh, that, those desos there. Luke's miners is going all the way down to top right. And Luke now, his units keep dying over and over and over to the drone ICs. 
So Luke has a big chance here to do something. The ore factory, I think, gets destroyed. And the sizable armor on the left side here. If you can get that death so deployed, that'd be great, but it doesn't. Good I see. Yeah. The one factory does go down, but it's not the worst thing in the world. That MCB was a clear clear, very clear target there, but it doesn't want to go for it yet. Meanwhile, the left side, the right, sorry. He's gonna push back with those must men in disc. No more brutes left or left either. Approaching uh, 19 minutes. Oh dear god. I think we're gonna have to push back the other one. <laughs> yeah, we're, uh, we're just over 30 minutes out. Mm -hmm. And it's 3 2 Luke, Luke, right? Right now? Yep, 3 2 to Luke. Well, Yuri is gonna be broke pretty soon here. The top right gems has been denied. There's no more aura left in base, and the only aura left available is bottom left. Yeah, now Luke's getting the rest of the gems up on the top right as well. Just taking the rest of them. <laughs> I don't think uh, Leo can actually prevent that in any way. Yeah. I mean, this Yuri army on the left side, four drones is more than enough. Even three. Because one will uh, transfer to the other. There you go. And the flight is second to take care of it. Yep. Mm -hmm. Not sure why he's pulling back to his rhinos though. Kirov reporting. And Kirov, nice. Yeah, Kirov. There we go. Yo, Bob, people use super champ. <laughs> yo, 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 gotta ask Matt for that. Did they use hairnets as well? I think Matt will have a well, Matt will have an answer. Double gear off that new king coming. Oh, that eco bottom left is being denied. Let's get mutated though to defend the couple mags and the cat that do get. Obliterated over time. The two warfare trees is a prime target, or this. Mm -hmm. I think the warfare trees would be better. There you go. Yep, down to one war factory now. Mm -hmm. So he can't be outproduced. Luke has two war factories. And his miners are long distance mining from heaven, dude. From top left yeah. all the way to top right. <laughs> yeah. That's far, man. I see drones again. Are we targeting the mastermind? There you go. Going in for the miners, yeah. All those masterminds are droned, except one. Should transfer over, I hope. Oh, it doesn't. Kills it. Yeah, Luke has been sort of pulling back whenever uh, a couple units gets in his base with his entire army. Oh, and the flax. Yeah, for the flax. Yeah, they can do a lot of damage, you know. Look at that, the war factory. But uh, he doesn't really care for that because he's getting some damage done. I mean, Luke, you can just go in here basically. He's being way too yeah, cautious he's here. he's got it. Good, good comeback, man, because he mm -hmm. was... I thought he was done after that Dominator. Yeah. Uh, Luke, but he had enough money to rebuild pretty quick there. Yeah. Look at that. Luke is tra Luke tracking back all the way to back in his own base around all the way and going on the other side. I, I don't really understand that. He's, uh, Leo's broke. Oh no, he has 4,000 now. He was just broke. Mm -hmm. I think the mutator probably helped him there. Got that oh, yeah. ice. I see now being right. popped. Surely he has to go in for the kill now after this I see goes for that army. Get a mastermind. There you go. Minus again being rejected down the bottom left. Look now 15k in the bank. Gonna push in now. This might be the end of Luke. He just needs to take out that last war factory. And he yep. should be good to go. Get in there. Ugh. Maybe he's gonna go around and go for the battle lab? That is an option. 
Nah, dude, he's gonna he's gonna go back to his base. He's scared of one mastermind. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe Luke is just trying to get Leo to quit. You know who knows? Yeah. There's a couple of Yuri Primes out as well. There's another Kirov. You know what Luke can do is just wait out for the Kirov to come in. Yeah. Then he can use the. Uh, uh, did you just four shield there? Yeah. Can use the Rhino to sort of zone out the Gats, so the Gats can't make any damage with that Kirov and just wait for yeah, it to come in. Yeah, he can definitely, definitely just steamroll in there now. Mm -hmm. He's just sweating it out, sustaining, making Leo quit. It's a mental game at this point. Mm -hmm. Here comes the IC. Go on, Luke. Finally gets a dumb the, the mutator out of the way. Next is the lab. And the chair comes out. Uh. Someone tell Mama Luke to tell him not to play with his food. And he's gonna back up all the way on. Where, where are the rhinos going, bro? This isn't the fucking marathon, <laughs> Luke. They keep and, going in a circle like that. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it, it, did it waypoint them? Oh, you're right. That's probably it. But oh, why oh, all I, 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 I think because he doesn't want them to get dominated, maybe. I don't know. Might be. You know? Just yeah, keep that, moving. yeah, that's why he waypointed learn, learn them around. That yeah. is true. If you can if you can time it right, if you can predict the movement, you might be able to. But there you go, Leo finally calls GG after 25 easy. minutes. And we're at match point now, huh? Yep, 42. So this map doesn't have any like uh, oil drills. What they're called? Yes, oil drills. That's yeah, it doesn't. Name. I think that's oh, the uh, that's the what you call it? The map that. I think Wave Pi or Chien made it. Not too sure. Player defeated. But this match point, I'll look at the scarcity, scarcity of the <laughs> goals on this map. Man, I think that's nuts. Yeah, I think this is gonna help uh, help it not be such a long match for sure. But they are. It is Yuri. They do have the mutator. They do have mm, the brutes. Yep, that's right. So they can definitely, sure. definitely do something about it. Should be nominated for worst map of all time. Uh, yeah, I guess some of you made this map actually. Yeah, Wavefire made this map. <laughs> and Wavefire also made uh, Dust Ravine, so. That's why I'm thinking that this map is, uh, which should be called the Broke Map. Which is why people play Yuri on it, and it's not in RE2. The Broke Ass Map, huh? Mm hmm. What maps could be worse than this? Nah, dude, that money's already going quick, man. I'm just watching those slaves, dude. They're... <laughs> they're doing work. Yeah. I mean, there's no mice to dig around. Digging for gold. Hmm. Yeah, canonical. I, I hope it doesn't go down to a very long match. Because there is a limited, limited funds here. They're going to have to do something else. They're probably gonna rush out for that mutator. Or get those gems going, in the middle. Luke going a little aggressive here. Already moving the MCV. Not sure if he's gonna move it middle or something. I think he is. Where to put it. Definitely not up the cliffs. He's gonna have to be down the middle. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna go aggressive. Like, really, really in his face. Is that the right play here? I mean, look at what Leo has. He can't push it back, but he's really taking a risk here. Oh, Whoa. he sells it no. after putting a Rex. No radar on one miner. It's bold. Every miner it's counts like a, here. It, dude, it's like a Soviet uh, rush, dude, with Yuri. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it makes sense if he makes corny. It's not. He's pumping on initiates. Every minor counts here for Leo, so that minor kill was absolutely crucial and Leo is using his miner to get initials out of the way which is causing him to mine 
decreasing his mining time now he's uh, technically down to two miners now at this point yep. this yeah, i might go down yep. and no radar so no mags to deal with that tower long range he's gonna have to go up front here definitely definitely an interesting strat from luke he does have one miner on the gems so eco wise it's not yeah, the worst thing that. in the world he's gonna target a miner but the mag is there from Leo. I don't think Luke can do anything with that mag there. Yeah, I think uh, since he had the one game up right now, he decided to just kind of aggro with it. <laughs> if it doesn't work out, then, you know. Yeah. So aggressive here and such a huge gamble. And all Leo had to do was make a radar and make a couple mags. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't think Luke is getting anywhere with this rush. Leo actually defends it pretty well. Yep. Oh dear boy. It's so not another 20 minute match, but pretty quick one. Might be four minutes here. Luke is going to be constantly hitting broke. So not much you can do. This should be a point towards Leo. <laughs> yeah, cool, GG, that's well, let's go. Not giving up, dude. Mm -hmm. Sending the brutes in. Oh, you're constantly hitting broke. Luke. Oh, I'll give it to him, though. He's not quitting just yet. He still thinks he can win this, but. Leo gonna teach him the hard way <laughs> not to uh, stay around for too long. Fire goes down. The rack is gonna go down. He's stuck on zero. Come on, Luke. Come on, Luke. It's the most polite thing to do. Yeah, yeah, Leo did use both of his videos. There you go, that's just easy. And Leo oh, starting Leo force on... Yeah. <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> We're not serious after this. I know. So after this was, uh, was that our game after this? Yep. In uh, 20 minutes, the TV2. Uh, hopefully, Papa is there. He said he would be free at this time. Papa Daddy. <laughs> He's a busy man. He's a busy man. Yeah. Because he has kids, right? Yep. He has an entire family. Yeah. yeah. What about your kids? Coming soon? Mm. More Connies. <laughs> yeah, once again. Um, I think this time like is an anti scout. Down. It should be an anti scout yeah. here. Yep. You don't rush Connie's on heck. <laughs> Gonna travel all the way from North Pole to South Pole. I mean, hopefully on heck, it's a lot more traditional. We won't see that much, but uh, Leo starting on a top right is actually a lot more defensive. Uh, the only choke points available for top right are those two choke points in the. Uh, the one down here and up here bottom left on the other hand has three choke points which is why i think the map is sort of weird in that kind of way bottom has three choke points top only has two but it could work on the Yuri's favor here i think leo is gonna send them is this gonna send all the way towards the gems no he's not okay one two three minus for each along with that radar Rhino tank Ooh. Go go There's it There you Got go it. That's a very early radar here Definitely liable if you're gonna go against Yuri Mhm mm you might go and just rush that actually straight away. What a bad idea. Can go harass a miner up top, top middle. 
Oh, there you go. Yeah, look, definitely making it a lot more interesting here than the typical waiting for that IC drone. Early game pressure on the minus, force him one way, send him the other. We can spend Lab. a little bit of money. Labs out for, uh, for both. There you go. Yeah, Luke definitely rushing that I see. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have to do a full body stretch after this match. It's gonna have way too long. Yeah, I see your stream's at four hours right now? <laughs> yeah, started like a couple hours ago. Are you playing FFGs too? Mm-hmm. Whole new map. So drones in the flak track, I think, from what I saw there. Ooh. Drones in flak. Going for the mastermind? Uh, I don't Might be. He has more things to worry about, though. Oh no, it's Adesso. It's Adesso. I thought right. it was a... Mastermind's yeah. right there, ready for it. Uh this in flight. Oh, it is getting the slaves on the bottom as well down the cliff. Should be annoying to deal with Leo has to micro that out of the way. He pushed on the left side there, just immediately pushed back by the Desos. But there's only one get in that army, so it should be pretty easy for Leo to for Luke, sorry, to get that out of the way if you target that get. He might just use his IC here. Not about shouts. I pop that IC. There you go. Yeah. yeah, bypass I get. You don't need that there. Oh, the mags on the cliff. Mm -hmm. The miner. One down. Two down. Three down. <laughs> Devastating. Yeah. That was a sneaky spot right there for the mm -hmm. mags. I didn't think of that actually when, uh, mm -hmm. when he was there. I think Luke probably begging or banking on that drone to do the work before the mags can be, the miners can be drone there. Yuri Prime was sneaking all the way down top left. One of two drones will be sent that way. Small army down in bottom right. Luke only on four miners. And he's broke. Yeah, I think he got and a couple his, miners though. And his mags are just, or his miners are just getting mag. Now he's down to three. Yikes. Uh, yeah. He's pressing he up on the. Uh, the yep. Yeah, that is true. Ooh. Then one health. Yep. Christ. I, I, Luke needs another miner here. I'll just move to the middle for for the gems. Can't hold on this broke in Zuri for that long. Ah, uh, yeah, so this is the first one. Second one gonna be tomorrow, uh, Monday, and then the third one gonna be on Tuesday. Nice drone there. Yep. I see probably not needed. Gonna sneeze. Ah, oh, fuck. I didn't sneeze. Sun's out. <clears throat> There's a mutator. Has Luke rebuilt? Yeah, he has rebuilt a couple miners. I just like to see him move his MCV a little bit here. He's still stuck on that one patch, and there's a lot of ore to the north of his base. Okay, now he's moving. Uh oh, night time. War factories and refinery goes down. So the miners again long distance mining. Leo now on three war factories with a lab super weapons tucked away nicely. Top right. Luke super weapons are spread out, but his MCV is not moving. There you go, there's the deploy. Yeah, I think the prime got hit by the rhinos that were here. Uh, along the left side. Mm 
Very, very definitely a very slow methodical game here. He's a player yeah. wanting to just sort of go all in. Which is uh, kind of the game you're forced to play when you're playing Yuri. Gotta go slow, gotta use the super weapons. Cooldown timer. Not really the best, most exciting game, but it is very interesting to see the sort of tight taste of the player going with here. Just like Luke here on the left side. It's gonna build down the cliff. We don't see this build often, but when we do, it's pretty good build. Drone I see on the right. Here they come. Go on, Luke. There's a nuke. Where's he gonna go? On the, the bottom radar. of the cliff? Yeah, radar. Yep. Nice. Wow, that's, well, that's a perfect nuke right there. Huge damage. You're getting two orphatches, radar, wow. and a grinder. Absolutely huge damage. It's gonna stall in the mag production for a bit. Luke in the meantime, regaining back his economy, makes a second MCV. It's gonna move all the way to bottom right. Yeah. Yeah, Luke's definitely turned it around. He got uh, Zico back up. That's what he needed. I think the only the only time Liwa has been pretty aggressive here was on the left push. And right now in the middle. So what he can do anything. There's no jets there, so he can uh he can just drone them straight away by the distance there as well. Mutator is ready, dominator is ready. Three war factories now with that grinder in the middle icy goes. So something we're used to seeing here is actually when a player drone, I see drones. Oof, the refinery and warfare are going down. Yeah, that's that's big right there. After when soul players playing against Yuri IC drones, they uh, split the drones in half and go for the units freshly out of the war factory. Mm -hmm. But uh, that doesn't seem to be happening for Luke. He's gonna pressure with the miners on the flag. Is he gonna help push them back? Couple lashes and gats here. To help defend and the defensive setup here from Leo is actually pretty solid. He has middle lockdown, the top split, there's a couple units there as well. Not gonna get through the middle, all bottom right is the only way that he can get through. Just where is it going currently? Yeah, we got some definitely some splits going on here. Mm -hmm. He's Uh oh the split top left yeah. not being and handled the and the prime too oh the mcvs oh prime target yep he's gonna run away oh the mag the bag oh, oh god damn oh gets it <laughs> he has a service depot though he has a second mcv bottom right anyway oh, the, the drone the drone uh oh, oh my nice. god good drones he does have another uh, service depot, so he can rebuild. Mm -hmm. And he right. has 20k. He has the MCB bottom so. right, when he moved earlier. Oh, yeah. yeah the second that. one. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's the idea of a split. Drones and uh, send the entire army on the right, the other yeah. side. It's like Leo just kind of pushing back here. The distant moss mines are there. Another MCV comes out of the war factory for Luke. He does have the money for a mutator goes on as well. Leo's still holding strong here at top right. He doesn't have the army numbers, but that is all you need is Yuri. Roots, you're gonna get countered by the flag pretty easily there. Yep. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. The lab. Yeah, long distance mining there from the miners. Easy target. Where are the flags there? They're trailing behind. Rhinos is gonna get hit beforehand. Where's he got his mind at? Some or his eyes on. His missile. Yeah, bottom right. Look at that. Yep. That's a split coming in from Leo. I see the MCV. Interesting. 
He does have a second one. Uh, totally yeah. not needed. I could have just sold that for money. Yeah. The flat is pushing way to top left. Now bottom right, MCB is surely gonna go down here. You might want to save it for that expansion, but uh, it dies anyway. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Luke can definitely push on the right side here. Yep. What does Leo have? Not much. Sending a mag and a masterman down the right side, but Luke choosing not to go down the right. He's gonna pull back to defend here on the left. Or a couple drones are incoming. The nuke is now ready once again. Can definitely hit the radar, that power plant between the radar and the war factory down in the middle ground. And the Bruce. Nine drones for one mastermind, dude. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, the Bruce man. doing a lot of damage to our bottom. Yeah. Right, let's not deal with it. You need flak all the drones. And here are the drones incoming now. Gonna deal with the additional units coming in from the top right and side. The map, the flak coming in, the four wow. shield. <laughs> No force at all, and the new taking out two war flashes on the top. Where was the force shield? Yeah, he had it. He wanted to use the nuke, but he didn't. He uh, he managed to get a nuke off before He's the force shield went on. Shooting his own war factory right now. Oh no, he caught it. <laughs> yeah, this game is nuts right now, dude. Mhm. Mm very back and forth. Very slow, but you know, we yeah. move on. Yeah. Yeah. More drones on the right side. Another push towards the middle. A get, two get, some mag and a mastermind. Went into a bar. What did they say? I want to free Yuri. And the drones going in the unit inside the war factory there. Big, big yikes from Leo. Not paying attention to the drones on the right side. More units getting droned. She's gonna have to do something about her drones, man. Three yep. war factories left. Mine are getting sniped out the way. Wave overload. Wave overload. Oh, Dominator just misses. If you would have sort of predicted the movement and then uh, pulled back, you might have dominated everything. Yep. A legend again jinxed it in chat saying that Dominator will end and it didn't end. Siege choppers are incoming. Siege chopper checking in. That'll do great. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. Mm -hmm. Wow. One, two, three, four, I, five war factories. I see siege choppers. Oh, <laughs> that'll be great. He's gonna go for the power. All the war factories, they're great at sniping building siege choppers. No power getting hit. No power. Luke. Uh oh. No force shield. Yeah, Time the lab is not out. Let me see him, baby. No, masterminds are there. Yeah, I, I don't think he can risk it or get there in time. He needs to get. Yeah, that's a great play to have the sea choppers getting a lot of value. Flight side going for that one miner. Uh, the, f the miner will win that fight. Right here. Another new comes right out. The radar. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Oh, it gives him back the power. Leo with 35k, 33k, no big deal. <laughs> <laughs> Man. He only has two rhinos in the field. And that miner yeah. in mid goes down. Leo, man, still holding on. Coming up to you about 20 minutes here. Yep. Knight's money goes down in the middle. Leo rebuilds. This is time putting all of his stack down top right. Squeezing into that far corner. I see ready. Gonna get the drones grouped. Oh, that's gonna be huge, the drones. Once he gets those masterminds out of the way. Can push in. The mastermind, there you go, gets droned. Will Luke end the game here? No. <laughs> we'll keep it going. No, yeah, it's like when he sends those ma those drones in to his pretty much his army, he should be sending his rhinos and all that whole army mm -hmm. on the other, you know. But they just, I don't know. 
I think the one thing is definitely because when, when you're when you're pushing Yuri, you can turn around in an instant with one Mastermind on the War Factory and one Mind Control Tower. Yeah, that may right. be why Luke is slightly hesitant, but he can with the Sea Choppers actually be a little bit more aggressive. Just what he's doing right now, getting that grinder and the racks out the way. He doesn't want to overcommit though. He is overcommitting. Chasing target there. And now he can arrest top left as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Legends right as well. And Yuri can win with one single dominator. Mm -hmm. And the dominator is ready, so maybe not the best place to attack now. Like top left, he could be dominator right now. There you go. And that was what Luke was probably wary about. And obviously the Dominator is instant. Not like uh not like in the rebellion patch where it's delayed by a couple seconds. Another nuke's gonna come out, he's probably gonna go for the battle lab in the war factory there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's fuck too. Either. Also mine? Oh, he does get drawn either way. Yeah, you're absolutely right with that new target. Oh, oh no. no! Nice. Power and the radar. There. Oh, the radar too, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah, definitely a lot of patience here from Luke. He's got a lot of rhinos. This is over. Yeah. He can finally punch through now. The Dominator is seven minutes away. But he is he's not splitting. gonna do yet. Yeah, that's a good thing to do. Getting hit, hitting all the miners everywhere. Do -do 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 -do. Bottom right, Neo pushing in. Yeah, it's better of those two masterminds there. One of them is overloaded, one that is drilled, no gas left remaining, he can push in. Overloaded the brainwave. Bottom right gets pushed away. Couple gas left in top middle. And the more masterminds incoming from Leo's main base. So they on the way obviously. The IC goes onto the rhinos. Get a Microsoft are out the way. Uh, that should be it. Leo again running away from one mastermind. In this case, it's fine. Four rhinos. Not enough to overload it. Look at the fuck ton of Kirov's incoming in the short amount of time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more factories. <laughs> Just quit, exactly. Here comes the Kirov's now. They're being split up. Ninth oh, war factory yeah. coming Soviet, out. Soviet invasion confirmed, dude. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I mean, what can Leo do here? Split up his gats? Not really a good idea. The wow. drones are now incoming. Crazy. Oh, the runners can come in. Or not. And Rhinos can hang back as well. You got Nuke and IC coming up. Get up reporting. There's still that Dominator that Luke has to worry about. So he needs to get him low power. There you go, there's the oh, Dominator. He does deal with that pretty easily, yeah. the tons of water. Oh man, here comes another nasty nuke. Yeah, on that lab, surely. Go far again. Bottom right, the uh, what's up for the Dominator? Yeah, the Dominated Rhino's running around all the way to bottom left. Another push coming in top middle here. We're coming up to 22 minutes in game. The Dominator tends to take yeah, care those, of. Those nukes have just been killing him, and he just can't rebuild his base. Mm hmm. You know, he's got the money. Oh my god, this game's at 22 minutes! <laughs> <laughs> oh dear god. And we're now, we're now three minutes over the start time. Yep. I'm gonna have to push the time back a little bit. Maybe about ten minutes or so. Because yeah. I need a break. Because I think this is... I think this is over. It's just a matter of time. It's definitely over, yeah. 
We started this game at about two and a half hours into my stream. It's now four and a half hours in, so this game is running for two hours in the best of nine. Usually a best of nine takes like 45 minutes. But <laughs> I mean, this is not much. Luke's just running away from the masterminds two, there. Two masterminds. You can definitely overload them. Just being a little bit cautious there, Luke. Yeah. Probably too cautious. Yeah, he's waiting for the drones to actually do the mastermind. Uh, taking out the mastermind instead of using his rhinos. Trying to build the sentry again as bait. Mm hmm. Looks like he's just gonna go into his base now. And then Luke. The, the more the thing is, the more Luke waits to go in, the more the Dominator will be ready. And the more yeah. he will back out. Because of that. Now his IC is ready. Uh, I, I I sure hope not, Andy. Where where are those tanks going? I see it's gonna go around the top in the middle. A elite get gonna come out in the bottom of the deso. And the crops AFK. Oh. There you go. This should be the nail in the coffin. There's a new once again, he's low power so he can't force shield. Kaboom. This should be the game. Why is Luke backing up all the way top left? I know. <laughs> and he sent like 20 rhinos for those two Gatling tanks dude. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the Luke definitely being very very cautious in his, in his gameplay. Doesn't want to get dominated. And now that the Dominator oh, is yeah, ready. Dominator is back up. Mm -hmm. There you go, Leo finally calls GG at 25 minutes once again. 25. Ah, uh, 25 Damn. minutes, and that is 5 to 3 to Luke.